right so last time we worked on this bending the character from the middle uh, to make it move uh, uh, turns towards the direction we are looking at but we have a small problem here so when I look completely back the character is not actually turning to that direction I'm not sure why so it only works when my turning angle is less than the uh, less than 90 degrees I think from the character's current forward direction if it is larger than that it's not working okay uh, let's see what's going on let me open the script right so all we do is uh, give some rotation to the spine of the character and the character movement happens based on the facing direction so here we have defined the facing direction um, let me check uh, what did I set it to yeah this forward transform this one right here let me move this part down and print the moment as well should give us a better idea okay let's turn to this way and moment is like that 2.1 minus 1 0 point minus 0 0.9 yeah one thing I notify uh, noticed is here uh, in the turn amount if the turn amount is larger than 1.5 or min less than minus 1 minus 1 1.5 it doesn't work let me show you again so if it is if the turn is less than 1.5 the absolute value it's fine but once it's larger than 1.5 in absolute value it character doesn't rotate anymore notice how it starts to turn when it is less than 1.5 now it's 1.5 okay now it is working see so uh, what I think is maybe we can clamp the turn amount between minus 1.5 and 1.5 let's see This is where we calculate it. So we can F clamp. This is the value. And max mean value is minus 1.5. F max value is 1.5 f positive let's see if that works oh it stops moving when I do that Uh, I think that's because forward moment is 
very small okay let's see where we set the velocity of the character right here uh, let me comment this part for a moment and let's set this to a fixed value for now and see if it works it should uh, automatically work no matter uh, pressing a moment key let me set this to 5 because I, I feel it's slow, too slow no oh wait it's not working at all okay so let's try changing this uh, I reverted that change I did before to this one and let's see okay so the problem that we had is we didn't have a forward movement so that's why character was too slow so yeah for a moment let me change this to one and see the character can turn back ah uh, yeah now it is working see okay now also i don't think we would need oh we can't actually use one because it should move forward only when i press only when i have a moment input also with that i don't think yeah let me put one here again and let me remove this clamp see if the character can turn completely back oh yeah it can okay so here what was before move dot is set right yeah so we should have the usual problem not being able to turn back okay now let's see where do we call this uh, okay. character move m move right so this is the part that we call the move function m character demo in third person user control so here the problem is when we look completely out of the forward direction more than 90 degrees i guess uh, okay why don't we print this and find the exact value where things it starts to go wrong so I don't think we need prints anymore so I'll comment those things oh, and we need to print 
more visit the forward amount actually oh we already had the forward amount printed yeah here we already had it the value minus zero point okay let's do something like this so this move dot is it should be one if the move magnitude is larger than zero how do we set it move magnitude larger than zero one otherwise zero so this is a one line if statement that returns so this part will return basically return one uh, if this condition is true if this condition is true it will return one otherwise it will return zero it's like a single line if condition okay now it is working properly All right, so we can stop this episode right here. So if you would like to support my work, you can get the membership of the Patreon Club. Link would be in the description below. And thanks for watching. Uh, the project files will be available to download through the Patreon page. And see you in another episode. Goodbye. This episode was sponsored by this generous patron. Thank you very much for your support.